Number 11 says to simplify the following, and it gives us this right here. But I'm actually going to rewrite this down here so it's a little bit easier on the camera for us. But essentially, when we're simplifying, if we look at these, what it's asking us to do is distribute these two into like one trinomial instead of two binomials. So when I'm looking at this, we usually use the word foil. Now, what does the word foil mean? Well, it just means that we're distributing, and this just helps remind us all the different terms that we need to multiply together when we are distributing. So first thing, this F stands for first. So we take the two first terms and we multiply them together. 3x times 4x is going to give me 12x squared. The O in foil stands for outside, so it reminds us that we have to multiply these outside terms outside of the two binomials. So 3x times the negative 6x would give me negative 18x. Then we have 5 times the 4x by doing our inside terms. So 5 times 4x is going to give me a positive 20x. And then we have our last terms, which is going to be 5 times the negative 6, giving me negative 30. Now the 12x squared and the negative 30 will stay the same, but these two terms will actually combine by doing 20 minus that 18 to give me 2 x. So we have 12x squared plus, because the 20 is larger, plus 2x minus 30. So if I look through my options, that looks like our final answer here is B.